Hey guys, welcome back to a brand new video. If you're new here, my name is Brianna and before you leave, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel to keep up with all of the videos that I post. It's Friday and today we are dedicating today's video to packing. We are leaving to Arizona for graduation and Josephine's birthday and semi vacation. So I've got a ton of vacation outfits that I ordered from Shein that I wanted to go ahead and show you and pack at the same time because I leave everything for last minute. But since the baby is at school, I figured why not? I have the time, I'm by myself, let's do it. So I've got that mountain of clothes right there behind me to go ahead and show you everything. I'm also gonna be getting ready probably like halfway through the video sometime. Um, I wanna do my hair and then feel film a reel for Instagram so if you're interested please keep watching so I have got my luggage and we've got this luggage like a really long time ago I'm not even sure where we got it but I know we got it like at a Marshalls or a Ross or something like that but um, you know me I'm always shopping at a discount really quickly before we start I want to show you my nails <gasps> look how gorgeous they are like spring nails wow like i'm gonna show you and insert the inspo that i showed her and this was a new place okay and they killed it like she did such a really good job i definitely recommend you checking it out if you're in the bedford area so so nice first things first something that i ordered on shein that i was like i wanted to see if the quality is just as good i got this little like sun hat i don't know if you can see like it goes really past my eyes completely and my mom was laughing at me but i think it's really cute if you like kind of fold it up this way with like a bathing suit am i the only one that sees this like vision very like hippie free people vibes and then i also got this one now this one has to be a free people dupe i've seen free people advertise this to me on instagram and on facebook and of course you cannot see my eyes but i also have like a really like small head and then like a long feature face but it is so cute and it's gonna go with the bathing suits that i ordered from there as well and then of course the hat so i feel like this is a dupe to a higher end hat but it's hobby so that you could totally tell is like from Shein. It even has like the little uh, year in the side. It is so cute. So let me go ahead and put the outfits together and show you what I'm going to take. This is bathing suit number one. I got it in a size extra large, so not in the curve area because I really wanted it to fit tightly around my stomach. So this is the first bathing suit. It has padding, adjustable straps, and then a really high back. Um... I love this one, especially because it holds everything in. Uh, for a cover-up, I've got two options. Okay, so I went ahead and ordered this white cover-up to go on top of the bathing suit. So it can just, you know, lay just relaxing, right? It just looks really nice. Um, obviously, it shows the color of the bathing suit because it is see-through. So if you order these, make sure that you're wearing them on top of a bathing suit because definitely see-through but that's the intention of it um but yeah this is going to be outfit number one i then ordered the same bathing suit in the green color they only offer two colors that hot pink and this neon green both are popular colors uh same structure same feeling except i went ahead and lessened the straps here at the top so that it can give me a more relaxed look and i think i like it like where it holds like everything together but it's the same feeling um definitely secure everywhere and then for the cover-up I went ahead and ordered this white little number right here I think it's considered like a cover-up dress it's so nice so I went ahead and got it right here look at how cute okay this in itself is like a complete look already like do you see what I'm seeing and then this is the back it shows like the bathing suit and i love that the green stands out with the white i could even also wear it on top of that hot pink style right there but what do we think this is definitely going to be taken with me i love it so so much so 
This is the third bathing suit. Now it doesn't come up as high as the other ones, which I'm not a really big fan. It also has like the same kind of coverage in the front and in the back is just a little bit lower. Um, this one is actually from the curve section. So the fact that it's not as high as the non-curve kind of confuses me just a little bit, but if I was taking this one because I'm not sure if I'm going to take it now, I would go ahead and match it with these lace pants, which I think I can do with the green bathing suit as well. They're bell bottom see-through pants and we're going to go ahead and try them on so I can show you what they look like. Well, the pants are on and of course the pants go higher than the bathing suit bottom, which I'm not a fan, on, a fan of. So let me go ahead and show you a full like view. Okay, so... This is what they look like on at the bottom. They're so nice. I think they're really nice for like a summer beach vibe. And then Coachella. These are, these are perfect for like a Coachella festival inspired um, outfit. So I'm going to take these even though I'm not going to take the black bathing suit. But I think I might take the top. So that's something that I have to keep in mind. So what do we think of this outfit? So of course this is a crochet like knitted um top that i can go ahead and button if i wanted to um the shorts are literally so silky smooth and stretchy i got them in a size large which you guys know that i usually go up to like a 1x sometimes but these shorts are so flowy to die for perfect for vacation with like a cute sandal what do we think this is totally my vibe um i love it so much and it's comfortable i still have that bathing suit under um yeah, I'm not like showing anything spillage. This is really cute. Um, I think I'm going to take this top because it is to die for. I love it so much. And I can even actually pair it with like denim jeans if I wanted to, which is also an option, but I will take them just in case. This is possibly another outfit that I could take. I love this so much. You guys know that I love two pieces so much because I could take the shorts, put it with a different top, and then the top with a different pair of pants. Um, I personally really like these together. The top is so flowy. I got these in a size extra large. Um, I'm obsessed with the color pink and anything like green and pink together. That is something that I have been loving so, so much. Um, it fits perfect on the waist really nice paper bag shorts so i'm gonna go ahead and add this to the maybe take me pile as of right now i'm just gonna go ahead and show you everything that i plan on taking but i'm not sure if i should take everything because i'm literally only going for a couple of days and i don't think we're gonna like do as many things as we think because the airbnb already has a bunch of entertainment so what do we think i love this one i think i might want to take the top maybe not the shorts and then pair it with like um, some of those cover-up bottoms. I don't know. Oh, if this doesn't scream vacation, I don't know what does. This is the most prettiest dress I have ever owned. It is so nice. It's a maxi. This one is for sure, for sure going with me. Anything flowy and non-tight. This is super stretchy back here. I love it so much. The only thing that I have an issue with is do I look pregnant? Like I hate dresses that make me look pregnant, but I'm so short and this is so long that I think it just, it's, it's inevitable for me. Like I am always going to feel like I look like that. So I'm just going to rock it and beat my insecurities. It is so nice. I didn't even have to unzip it to fit in it. It was a size extra large. I actually could have downsized to a large so that it could fit me a little bit tighter, but I really do like the fact that it fits me perfect right at the back, but this is definitely a go-to. So I'm going to go ahead and pack this in the suitcase. This one is a for sure. So this is another two-piece outfit that I really fell in love with on Shein's website. It's got a really nice slit here at the top. It's extremely high-waisted, so it covers everything that I'm insecure about or that I am iffy about. And then it's got a really nice coverage top. I really love this, but does it give like Arizona vibes or does it give Cancun vibes? Because I don't want to take something that makes me feel like, oh, I'm in Cancun, but I'm really in the desert. But I really want to take it because you never know. You never know what can happen or what you can do. So 
I don't know. I love this so much. I got this in a size XL and it definitely fits very roomy, especially up at the bust. Um, but the top is to die for. This is another option I am thinking about taking it just in case we have to do something formal. This is by far one of my favorite outfits. Reason number one being is because these palazzo pants they're so stretchy they're so comfortable and they are actually like a really soft thick material but still really breathy and airy the only issue is that i'm short and so they go extremely long but that is not an issue this top is so cute but it's got like a lot of material right up in the front um this is what the back looks like i love this top so much anything that doesn't require me wearing a bra i love it it's balloon sleeve it gives me that vacation vibe i could wear some sandals with this and we are good to go I started on my hair obviously because i look a little bit more put together but i really quickly wanted to show you the rest of what i'm taking to arizona for like packing essentials um that i got on shein so the first thing i want to show you are these like suitcase squares um, so that you can get more order so you can get more organized as you can tell like my mind is running like a thousand miles per hour um, I have to go pick up Josephine still I dropped off cupcakes for her birthday a lot of momming today it comes with separate compartments for literally everything like there's so much i'm gonna leave a picture so you guys can see exactly everything it comes with because it's got like a little makeup bag more pouches inserts i'm definitely gonna go ahead and use this for my heels like the ones that i want to keep protected these are so nice and convenient and honestly a lot more affordable than marshall's and ross then i went ahead and got a vacation tote bag um this is going to keep all of our essentials um regardless of my purse i'm going to go ahead and put like the snacks and all of the baby's like essentials here like uh, products that we need deodorant stuff like that you have to have with you you know like you cannot go without so this is the bag that i got it is so cute and then when i come back from vacation i can always use it regardless of vacation or not because it is so cute i think i saw something similar at h&m but i got this one for a lot cheaper it's got functional pockets like zippers and uh, insert so nice well because i am going to like a more fancier event um i went ahead and ordered like a jewelry um holder for my rings uh, my necklaces things that are really fragile and need to go inside of a safer place i've traveled with jewelry before and it just did not work out for me and so i stopped traveling with jewelry after that experience but i went ahead and ordered one of these little bad boys that i've seen everywhere on tiktok that they say that they ordered it from amazon but i ordered mine from shein that was much much cheaper all right, so now that we are done putting everything away, I've got dresses, bottoms, tops, bathing suits, chonies, lots of personal care items. And then in this one, I think I have more personal care items. Millie just is so surprised with everything that's going on. She has no idea that she's coming with us on a road trip. Right, me? <laughs> has been so hectic today i am now vacuuming javi's truck um i'm really ocd when it comes to like the space that we'll be in for a long period of time like it needed to be clean and just so that we can get around i've done too many road trips to know that being in a messy car really elevates my anxiety especially driving with a toddler so we're gonna go ahead and vacuum the seats the front you know all that good stuff so i am back now from vacuuming the truck and i am so hot and sweaty um i definitely need a shower but i wanted to go ahead and show you a couple of things that i got from ulta yesterday so that i can go ahead and take on this trip with me um not a lot of like bougie things but more affordable items i got my favorite mascara from maybelline which is the sky high i haven't had or tried the black one i've had the pink one so i'm excited about this one um, I also got like a eyebrow defining um, gel, which is something that I've been wanting to try and it was like $2. Um, I also got this NYX lingerie XXL, which 
let me tell you i tried it on my hand like i swatched it on my hand and it would not come off unless it was with like a lysol wipe and even then it was like really hard to um get off the next thing i got which i'm so excited about which i've seen a couple of times and didn't really take the plunge to purchase it is this morphe 2 quad goals multi palette thing um it has like an eye cheek lip and sparkle for like highlight or like inner corner of the eye it is so nice i'm gonna go ahead and open it for you and then i'm gonna put it in my makeup box because the makeup box is just gonna come with me completely i'm not even gonna take it apart because i'm not gonna do all that trouble so this is what it looks like they've got so many different finishes and like shades these are the shades that it comes with so very natural and neutral colors something that i feel like i'm always drawn to um so look at the sparkle on this i don't know if you can see it it's so nice i think it was like 16 dollars. i also had like um points which i i never know that i have points at ulta and then i get there and i can go ahead and save eight dollars so that's always nice so these are just some of the things that i got from ulta for my trip all right guys, so we are closing out the video right here. I showered, we've got everything packed and all we need now is just Hobby to get in the shower and to go. Um, so I'm gonna close it out right here because it's gonna get really hectic as we all load everybody into the car. So I'm gonna try my best to vlog this journey of ours. So stay tuned, no promises, but I really hope that you enjoyed today's video and I'll see you next time guys, bye.